Tell us what's right. going on. Rookie error. Some clown set my maximum throttle to 181. Yes. So we're only getting 8 amps through the pack, yep. not the full capacity which we tested an individual motor at, which was 5 amps each. We're only getting 8, not the So seven. what does it set to now? So now it goes up to 2,000. Yep. I still think it's not right. But That's we'll okay. 2,000 is the right, it was right amount. Then we put the meter on it and it was about 13 amps, 12 yep. or 13 amps. Yep. So that's through all three motors. Yes. So yep. that's 30% more power. All right. So Derek's just going to give us a quick power test. So it, it still doesn't quite feel like um, Skid Mark 1 mm -hmm. with the 10 amp ECSs, but it's close. Okay. And we're running the 610 Rhino yes. uh, 20C pack. Yes. Yep. For that, some reason, this thing's not starting up. That's anymore. the recommended uh, pack for this thing at the moment. Oh, you know why? Because my trim's not right. Ah. Uh, okay. No, it did it then. No, it just no. took a little while. It's, of course, it's, um, you know, you said trim it. I trimmed it and yep. it wouldn't calibrate. It's crap. Okay. Crap. All right. Hey, um, some of the crew they just kind of the right. Oh, it's got a bit of a hum in it. See that little white waggle? Yeah. I think one of those props might not be balanced. Yeah, well, you've got to do your balancing, man. All right, bit of a power test. Whoa. <laughs> I think that rear props out. That's yeah, because it wasn't doing that last time. No, no, it's definitely. Balancing props on this is an absolute must yeah. given its weight. See that little out of balance props causing it to drift left? Yeah. Right, another test. Whoa, man, that is out of sight. Cool, Derek. Try keeping it. No, it's I've got nice. to change that prop. Oh my god, I picked up someone, someone else's transmitter. Alright, thank you.